Good afternoon, Viva MK. Thank you for joining me for this Facebook Live business update on Thursday, the 12th of March, 2020. And of course, this is the first time we've spoke uh, since the showcase. So thank you to all of those, all of you who attended the showcase. It was obviously a tremendous event based on your feedback and of course all the sh usual shenanigans that happened on the day. Thank you to our very own Jean Day for closing the day in her usual fantastic style and a great content of training as well. The feedback for you, Jean, as always, was quite, quite remarkable and quite unbelievable. Not unbelievable in that, that I wasn't expecting it, but unbelievably good is what I mean. So thank you for that. As always, leading the way right from the front with really appropriate training. So I'd also like to, at this moment, thank the brand directors, the beauty brand directors, who were absolutely fantastic on the foyer with their samples of products and their demos. Thank you to all of you really adding value to the business as the Sparkle team are. And of course, as the advocates already have started doing, people often wondered what was the point of having these groups of people well you're seeing the benefit of that already not only have we have had increases of sales to what the sparkle team and the brand directors are doing it's projecting the image of the business it's putting people at the helm of it but even the advocates and it's only been a few days and there was more than we expected but the value they're already adding and you'll see the benefits of as we go forward is absolutely phenomenal phenomenal thank you to all of you and the rest of you will see what's been going on when I share some of the plans with you of what we've all been discussing and there's much to be said of putting people right at the front of the business you know that's what I've always always wanted to do have people at the front of the business have people representing the business have people in positions that were never possible in organizations before or in many organizations now there's not many companies that will push people right to the front of the business and have them at the helm not only guide and helping with the business but being a very strong part of it you know that's always been our ethos you know putting people first so let's talk about business catalogs the summer catalog of course went on sale this week we have sold over 75,000 copies of it already that simply means that within a matter of day 75,000 catalogs plus will be out in households now that's a phenomenal result for us the fastest selling catalog we've released in the six months we've had this second version of the business now they're still of course available um, and as you know the summer catalogue is our second departure of what we used to call the main book. And so far, again, your feedback has been phenomenal. Your feedback is always representative of how your customers are going to actually view the catalogue. And that suggests, based on your feedback, that the result is going to be quite fantastic. So I really look forward to that. So 75,000 plus out there already. That's half of our contingency already gone. So like I say, our fastest selling catalog to date. Um, next week is all about um, gardening and outdoors. Next week, you'll get the full PDF of that catalog and ordering details. Of course, that leaves three catalogs for the rest of March. We're still on track for those, but I'll keep you updated as each week and each day goes by. But next week, like I say, it's all about outdoors and garden. And again, I think you'll be very pleasantly surprised with some of the content of the catalog, and so will your customers be. So the other three, of course, as you know, is Beauty Book 2, um, the Personalized Catalog, and of course, House Proud 3. And House Proud 3, again, will have some very exciting products in there, very exciting innovation for us. Remember that, exciting product innovation. So onwards to the summer event, tickets went on sale yesterday. 70% of the tickets are already sold for the summer event on the 6th of June in um, the Crown Plaza, Solly Hill. You need to be there. The ticket price goes to normal price again at 9 a.m. tomorrow, so get your tickets today. It will sell out. They are limited seats. And I think sometimes the value of having a limited event to get people really surging forward and filling the room is really powerful. So I did change the venue. It's a very plush venue, but I think you'll appreciate for those of you that are going and as you can imagine 
There will be the usual shenanigans, but this time summer shenanigans. And by then, in the long, hot days of summer, even though 6th of June isn't actually officially summer, with long, hot days of summer, everything that's happening currently will be long forgotten, one hopes, and we will be celebrating the last three months of the business and the three months ahead of us. And that's what I said we'd do with each event. Celebrate what's happened in the last three months. And, prog and, and and talk about the next three months. And if we keep doing that, that means not only are we growing, but we're looking at ways of progressing. And talking about progressing, I want to just talk about these amazing products. Of course, as you know, launched at, um, at the showcase, our brand new eco-friendly, people-friendly ranges. Now, just bear in mind, these are 750 ml bottles, so they're quite big bottles of product. Um, they're in full production as we speak, specially made for us, but the unique selling point isn't just the fact that they're eco-friendly, they're pet-friendly, they're vegan, they're non-toxic, they're pet-safe, they're non-carcinogenic. It's not just that. It's the power of the products because normally eco products have this image or perception that they're not going to work as well as the normal abrasive toxic products. I can guarantee you because the manufacturer has guaranteed to us that these products will work as well as any abrasive toxic product out in the marketplace today and you know once we have these in stock the sparkle team who are already doing some amazing work with what they do will be the first to sample these test them hopefully do plenty of videos for us to put out to the world now as we speak today our website www vivamkplanet.com is live do check it out what that is is information for your customers the website will be written onto the bottles it's an informative landing page only that gives people information of what we want to do and of course gives them the opportunity to ask us if uh, for any further information do you know how people really want to know what we're doing to reduce our footprint now like I said at the showcase, we may not be able to change the world with our products, but it's a start. It really is a start. And if we can at least reduce our footprint as the people's business, that is a big start for us. And I know we're starting with three products and they're very powerful products. You'll see how well they work when you get hold of them. You'll see the logo that we are using uh, to demonstrate our people-friendly and eco-friendly products. But you'll see how well they work. But not only that, we'll be extending the range and further products in the range are already being formulated. But things that you truly want. Now, the idea behind it was that we really wanted eco-products that are you know, um, vegan, non-carcinogenic, etc., etc., but that work very well. So we searched, we searched hard to find a company that could produce those for us. Hence the backup website. Do check it out. All your customers will see it, and we'll give them all the information they need. It's live now. Like I say, www vivamkplanet.com. The whole idea, like I say, we may not be able to change the world. But what we can begin with, at least, is to reduce our footprint upon it. And if we can do that, then these are going to be a massive niche success for us. And you'll see when the Sparkle team get hold of them a few days before the rest of us, how powerful these products are. And that's really new for us and really exciting. But they're not going to stop at those three. There's more being produced. So on to retail sales. Um, as you know, every week we celebrate uh, the top 20 people who've done the most sales in every week of every period. So I'm going to give you the top five for a week two period three. And of course, the sales are gradually growing as we predicted, um, even though what people say, you know, we're in the quieter part of the year. No, 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 far from it. Our retail sales are progressing and they will progress even more as each catalogue comes out this month. So in position five for week two, period three, is Stacey and Jonathan Beck. Great to see your names on there. Number four is Stacey Maddox. Number three, Kevin and Lisa Ratton. Number two, Stephen Payton. And number one, the outstanding retailers of the year, Ali Lloyd and Jeff Locke. Congratulations on being number one. In fact, congratulations to all of you for doing anything you do in the business. That's week two, period three. 
There has been some confusion of what you need to do to keep your account active. Uh, that's just my wording that didn't really help that earlier in the week. So let me quickly explain to you what is necessary in the business as far as keeping your account active is concerned. We only started our period calendar this year, so we're only halfway through period three. To get downline commission, if you are um, viable for downline commission or if you qualify for downline commission, you have to do £45 worth of product sales in a given period to qualify for down, downline commission. That's straightforward. To keep your account open so it stays active, it's a £45 order within three periods of business. So within three periods, within 12 weeks, you have to put a £45 order in. As this was the first period of three periods we've had, any order, if your account hasn't done anything in the next two weeks, will keep your account open and that will keep it open for the next three periods. Now, the reason we have to have this restriction is not just because each account costs money to keep it active in our current IT system. Not just that reason, that's just a nominal charge. It really is to support the most active people in the business. Um, and, and you know, that that's, that's what we've always done in previous businesses and this one as well, that, you know, at a, after a certain amount of time, an account just goes inactive and it's no different here. Except here, we do have a minimum order for you to actually keep that active. If there's any further confusion of that, of course, let me know. There's no point sometimes um, just wondering about it. You only have to drop any of us an email and we can answer those questions. Um, so hopefully that's cleared that up. Um, in respect to the business in general, of course, business has been phenomenal this year. We've had a great start to the year, um, better than anticipated, better than forecast. Um, in February, we had the greatest recruiting month we've had since we restarted. So people are coming back into the business, not only regenerating their account, but brand new people as well. And again, that is, exceptional for any business of our stature to get people in and get them retailing. And of course, as our catalog offering improves and increases, that will happen, that, that will create even more sales and more people coming into the organization. So as far as that's concerned, you know, everything is moving in the right direction. So I just wanted to give you this quick recap on what's been going on. Everything is moving in the right direction. We had a phenomenal showcase, there's no doubt about that. Um, you know, we've got a brand new IT system and I refuse to talk about that anymore because as you know, every time I've mentioned IT systems, something goes wrong. Our history of that dictates that goes back years now, but we are working on it as I revealed at the showcase. Um, we, we, we're fine with the current system. It may be cumbersome, but it gives us what we need for the moment. Moment, but as far as innovation for the future is concerned, we do need a system that backs every, up everything we do. One that has personalized websites, it has personalized back office, and gives you a very personalized link to recruit people into. Far more formalized than we have currently today. Again, we're working on all that. So as you can see, there are great things happening in the business. Now, it's a strange one, isn't it? It's a strange era that we're going through in the world as we currently speak. You know, it, we're in March 2020 and many of us were expecting uh, flying cars and communities on Mars. But currently we're teaching people how to wash hands and of course toilet paper is worth its weight in gold as we speak. Nobody's expecting this. Now I won't make light of the potential threat that our country could potentially be under. However, I can't also represent the World Health Organization in what's going on. Um, I will keep you abreast of how um, COVID-19 affects our business on a weekly basis. If it does, of course, there's been little effects in supply and demand. That was absolutely understandable that that would be the case and that may get worse, but I'll keep you abreast of that as much as possible. Communication is key in these situations. And like I say, I don't represent the World Health Organization. I can only relate to you what's out there in the media for all of us or, or what's coming from official bodies for all of us. And we'll keep abreast of that. Now, this could be a chance that our service 
could be a massive service to the world. I don't know. And I don't want to sound mercenary because the most important thing, if we are the people's business, which I truly believe we are, is to put yourself first. And your personal safety will matter more than anything else. I don't think there's anything else I can say about it at the moment because I know as much as you do. You know, there's many business operations that we have to try and stay abreast of and that we have to try and forecast how and what the challenges are going to be. But as the country doesn't know, as the government doesn't know, I'm not really one to comment much more on that other than to say that we will keep communicating to you as we did with the clean easy mop and bucket earlier in the week. That was the first real effect of the virus is that we had our our initial order slashed by 75% because of components that were coming from abroad. Um, it's undoubtedly will affect us more, but we'll keep abreast of it and we'll keep communicating. That's all we can do is keep communicating, but put yourself first. You know, personal safety is very, very important. No one knows how this is going to end up, but we will do our best as a community of distributors and a community business, we'll do our best no matter what the circumstances are. And that's all we can possibly do as well as keeping the lines of communication as open as possible. Uh, just before I forget, so that's really all there is on that. But just before I get the, the timeline of, on these is still a couple of weeks they're in full production because I didn't give you a timeline. Again, we'll communicate that um, if not tomorrow, then early next week as to when they're arriving. There will be the odd delays with things um, being manufactured because a lot of manufacturers of products like these, of course, have been sanctioned to make more antibacterial things for across the world. There is a lot of that going on. As a business, of course, we're going to do the best we possibly can, not only for each other, but for you personally, but uh, uh, as far as the community is concerned. So Viva MK, you know, um, it's been a brilliant year. I thank you for all the support that you give the business, but more importantly, the support you give to each other. I've never known a community like it. And, you know, we've come from fairly powerful business communities. But the support that you offer each other, cross-line, down-line, up-line, is the greatest I've seen in the industry. And, you know, I've had many links in the industry across many years, not just in Clean, Easy and Betterware, but many other organisations. But I've never seen the camaraderie that we have got. It was represented at the showcase. You'll see it again at the summer event, but you see it in every thread of the business, how people are just supporting each other. Now, that potentially, like I've always said, could be one of the greatest selling points that we have in this organization, not just when there's a threat over the country, but as a community of business people. You know, many companies say that they support each other, but to actually see it happen day in and day out is a, an absolutely phenomenal place to be. So thank you for doing that. Thank you for doing that for each other. Thank you for doing that for our community. These are, amidst anything else happening, still exciting times for our business. And every week of March and every week going into April, you'll see new things happening. But for me, just going back to this, this is one of the most exciting things happening in our organization. If only to help reduce our footprint on the planet by a tiny bit, then we'll be doing our part. As I said, the products, we may not change the world, but to reduce our footprint is a great start. So thank you for listening as always. Undoubtedly, I'll speak to you sooner or later. You know we're always around for any information that you need. We're always open to communication. Don't ever hesitate. And I know most of you don't. And just um, keep on doing what you're doing. And that is the connection that we all have. Thank you for that. And I'll uh, catch you soon. Bye-bye.